What's going on YouTube? I'm Phil. Hey, this is a little bit of a different one and uh, I've been doing a little bit of self-reflecting and uh, maybe this might resonate with some of you guys and maybe the reason why you're not in love or you haven't found love is because you don't love yourself. What do I mean by that? You, you always let yourself down. Um, you disrespect your body through drugs, alcohol, gambling, porn, uh, masturbating, lying to people, womanizing, um, not keeping your word to yourself. See, all these things trickle into other stages of your life. And I've just been doing some self-reflecting because I am single, but if I'm honest with you, it's I can be honest and say that I really didn't love myself. Uh, and I was proving it through my actions of partying nonstop, doing multiple days uh, partying and not coming home. To, to telling white lies, not being direct with people, uh, all that kind of stuff. Maybe that is the main reason why uh, I'm single and I'm paying for some karmic debt. And that's why the right person hasn't maybe come into my life. And that's okay. I think that uh, I am paying for karmic debt and I've been trying to kind of make things right and be a good person. And over this last six months, I've really made an effort to change. And I really do think that I'm becoming that person that's going to attract that person. But as of right now, it's we're grinding and I'm living for you guys. Like this channel is about you guys. I actually get up for you guys. It makes me feel good that I can pass on a few things, pass on knowledge, pass on a anything that I've learned, any mistakes or whatever. So you don't have to, you know, maybe you don't have a, a voice like, you know, maybe you don't have like a platform. You don't wanna jump on, on board to say these things, but I'm telling you guys, you're not alone. If you're finding yourself alone and you know, you're at your house and you know, no one loves you and you know, you don't have a network or whatever, you can salvage it. You just gotta start. Like I've I've been making steps to meet new people. I've met some wonderful people in the last six months because I'm creating that person, becoming that person that attracts these people, you know? And these are people, these are people, these are more friends, if anything, you know, I'm getting a newer circle of friends. In different stages of your life, you're gonna be making new friends and that's okay. Some people have to go to make way for the new one. So like, and that's that's kind of what's happening. So that's a plus. But in the meantime, you know, like you might not be there like on your own personal life. And that's okay. What I'm trying to tell you is that you need to become a different person that attracts the type of person that you want. Like you need to ask yourself, what would, what would that person be looking for? Stop looking about what you want and why you're so transactional and go create that 10.0 version. I guarantee you that if you're the same bloke that trains every day, never skips a meal, doesn't lie to people, is respectful, provides, uh, he's a protector, he looks out for his people. He's that person that has answers whenever people have problems. I guarantee you, you're going to be attracted to someone. You know what I'm saying? So it's already happening like with myself. Um, this is the thing with me. I'm attracting, uh, I'm, I'm attracting sexual interest, but not like lifelong partner kind of interest. You know what I'm saying? So like I'm done with the whole sex thing. I'm telling you guys right now, it only gets you so far, maybe because of all my womanizing and stuff that I have been indulging in the last six to 12 months. Maybe that's costing me. Maybe that's God saying, you know what, Phil? Fuck you, you know what I mean? You will not find that because you can't have this and that. You can't be living two lives, you know what I mean? You can't be walking two paths. You need to walk one path. So I've decided that I'm not gonna be womanizing like that anymore. That's the last thing I had to give up and that's what I'm gonna be sticking to. So if I don't have sex in a long time, that is a consequence that I'm willing to take. Uh, it's been hard <laughs> because it's not normal for me, but uh, yeah, I'm just gonna stick strong now. This is the way, this is the last thing that's kind of robbed me. I think that the reason why I'm not somewhere in life is because I've always been chasing women uh, to a degree and just like making that a priority, but not anymore. I wanna change my life. So uh, yeah, it, it, things have to change and I just can't be running around or whatever. So if there's, if there's a reason why, if you think, oh, why aren't I yet there with someone yet or why can't, you know, someone pick me or whatever. Don't think like that. Just go create the best possible version of yourself. Don't ever think like that. Just do you, create the best version of yourself and then as a byproduct, females will be attracted to you, I promise you. 
it's already happening. Like it's already happening here. I'm not getting the attention that I want to be getting. I'm, I'll be honest with you, like in many ways, uh, by the right girls. But like it's coming nonetheless, and that's the thing. Just keep working on yourself, and then you will eventually be undeniable to anyone, male or female. You know, whatever your whatever your orientation is, and someone's going to find you attractive. I guarantee, if you're in the best shape of your life, you're the smartest you've ever been with the best network, most financial resources, you're you're going to clean up, guys. So, change the shift of yeah, like chasing that and become first, become that person in turn that attracts whatever he wants. So if you're feeling alone, the answer is to work harder. Any problem in life, the answer is just work harder. And and that's it, like that's just a little bit of an update with women for me, what it's cost me. I think that chasing women is just a dead end game. Like it's just, I'm not gonna do that again, I'm done. And that's it, like I'm not, I'm not doing that again and I'm just gonna be, Focusing on this, is it a little bit of a dry spell now, these last three, four weeks? Absolutely, but it is what it is. Like, I've just got to choose another way. Well, if I was chasing women, like, uh, chasing is not the right word, but if I was constantly seeing women, uh, yeah, like, and I still haven't locked down a life partner, maybe I better change it up. That's why I'm changing strategies. Like, if you keep doing the same thing, like, expecting a different outcome, that's insanity. Like it's been, or however that quote goes, it's been mentioned a million times, but guys, just change, change your mindset, become that person who will attract anything in turn in life, become valuable, become the most 10.0 version of yourself. And uh, you will find that someone, someone will, someone want to, yeah, <laughs> someone will be fucking dying to be with you. So anyway, I love you guys and um, I'll chat to you in the next one, all right? So cheers.